Season 6 is finally here. That means new guns, new camos to unlock. And today, we're going to be getting the grab Dark Matter. If you want to unlock the grab, it is tier 31 on the Battle Pass. I bought the little bundle that gave you the extra tiers. Then I had some leftover tier skips. So I went ahead, got the grab early. And also, we've used it a little bit in Zombies. If you want to see that, I'll have the link to that live stream when Season 6 went live right here. But I have not used it in multiplayer yet. But I do have, I do have some attachments on it. Maybe we'll go... You know what? Screw using attachments. I'm going to go in completely vanilla see what it's like with no attachments on it before we just start throwing random stuff on it and it looks like we have a few new maps here we have face off on glue boco d program and i think there's a map called america with like a k uh it takes part i'm pretty sure in part of the new zombies map which is also a campaign map it's everywhere every mode anywhere you want it that map's there but i think i'm gonna play on d program here might as well test out the new map if this is the map i think it is this is just gonna be like uh like almost a combination of a bunch of different maps oh wait 14 we're already getting numbers in here stuff's floating so i think this might just be like we're like inside adler's brain and he's messed up let's go this map looks sick a door comes in oh that's that entrance is amazing probably the coolest entrance we've had on a multiplayer map we got stitch all the way up there chilling oh what's up man all right now all that's left to do is test out the grab here there's no attachments easy headshot he's probably already low oh this is sick this is a little arcade from pines as well as i don't know where this little uh bunker thing is from this little shed so far this map is looking pretty cool i think we got domination too okay, there's people right up here oh i didn't look to my right in case you're curious this is the inspect on the weapon looks pretty standard you hold it up there for quite a long time though i like that gives you a little more time to uh, you know get a thumbnail Let's go through the, the red door. What happens here? Oh. Very extremely white room. This is like blindingly white. That's probably by design. We got a guy right here. Slapped them. Might as well just chill up here. There we go. It's a quick two. I haven't played multiplayer on this in a bit. I'm so glad we have more camos to get. Oh, that's taken out there. All right, we tried it vanilla a little bit. I know I said screw attachments, but if we got them, might as well use them. Cobra red dot. We'll do muzzle break. Um, uh, Ranger barrel. It's hard to do this in game. Five milliwatt SWAT. We'll get cruiser grip for that movement speed. 40 round speed mag. Um, speed tape and marathon stock. Okay, probably not the best class to be using, but we're using it. And they have a chopper gunner. Okay, now we have our attachments on it. Probably good that chopper gunner took us out anyways. That way we can refresh our attachments. Easy kill there. Oh, let's go. Nice little hip fire there. So far, this weapon seems pretty good. The recoil on it isn't too crazy. Uh, if it's like anything like that in Warzone, this gun's got to be busted. Oh, come on. Let me do the cave. They're spawn trapping us. Just got to run. Stay away from me. Okay, we made it in. Somebody's in here though. There we go. One. Oh, I was going to say one more, but we got got. Somebody's got to be over here. I can feel it. Put on this field mic. Oh, they have a counter UAV up. Perfect. There we go. Easy kill. Another one. Nice little double. No. Oh, can't get the triple. Too many people. The game's also kind of running like awful. Probably because I just got done streaming. But if you haven't watched already, if you haven't seen any of the streams, we do stream here on YouTube as well as Twitch. But if you don't want to miss any of those streams, make sure you turn notifications on because it will let you know when we start streaming. It's always a good time just hanging out with you guys. Oh, it's not a good time just getting demolished. You know what I need? I need to hit a Tommy. Oh, halftime. That saved you. Now we can check out this side of the spawn. Pretty cool. It's sick how this thing is just all a dome and you can see all like the coding, all the numbers around it. Pretty sick. This map's design is really nice. Who wants to catch the first tomahawk of the season? Anybody? Oh, somebody pushed behind. This guy. Wait. This guy does. Oh, I missed it. He was ready for it. Oh, let's go. I need to hit a tomahawk. That's that's how I power up. Easy kill. He was low. Nice. Another one on a triple. Our first spy plane of the match. I'm so bad at this game's multiplayer. Oh, no. There we go. Oh. Teammate, get him. I also still have... I'm going to turn subtitles on. Have those on for zombies. I'm trying to figure out the new map. Oh my god, that was abysmal hip fire. I don't know how I got away with that kill. Another one. I'm back on it. And he's down. Yeah, I keep talking about it, but I'm not about that action. Oh, I almost got the tomahawk there. You guys are ruthless. They won't let me get one. Come here. No! Someone's over here. I can smell it. Right here. No, come on, throw the Tommy. I probably shouldn't have mantled. All right, we're getting a Tommy before this game ends. Oh, that's Adler. What's up, Adler? Right here. We got a Tommy and a kill right after. We're in this. 
we're back, baby. And we're gone. Let's throw in the armor. That'll help out. This map is honestly not that bad. It's not as fast as a nuketown would be, but it's also not big and like full of just useless spots on it. So far, it feels like it has good flow. It's got a care package. I'm going to kill him before he can take it. Oh, too late for that. Let's go. I think we both had armor there. I just barely outlasted him. Did somebody just try to tomahawk me? Are you kidding? Where? Where is he? I just want to talk. How do I get up there? Like, actually, how do I get up here? I've been up there before. I don't remember how. Oh. Ooh, he almost got me with that shotgun. Very dangerous game I'm playing. Oh, can I get the hip fire kill? This feels so weird. I've been playing zombies for so long now. I feel like I forgot how to play multiplayer. He tomahawked me. All right, if I see a guy with a purple shotgun, he's getting it right here. No, sentry gun, you took away my satisfaction. Hey. I'm so bad at multiplayer now. Get down from there. Oh, so many people. Oh. I had to pull out the marshals. I was scared. We got a shard camo there. That's our first camo with this gun. At least we, we picked up a camo this game. This gun doesn't feel bad, though. Sometimes ARs come out. You can tell right away, like, they're kind of mid. This one has got, like, really, really easy to control recoil. Not bad damage output. Its fire rate isn't terrible either. It's pretty decent. Pretty decent gun. But I'm going to go ahead and get this weapon Dark Matter. I'll give you my full review of the weapon after it. But for now, enjoy these highlights. As you just saw in that last clip, I did end up getting the grab dark matter, but there's a few things I need to address since our first game. First thing, don't know how I didn't notice this, but why is Nuke Jack back? Hijacked is nowhere near a new map in this game. This was released like months and months ago. Then I understood it. It's like, oh, new map. Let's put it in with Nuketown. Cool. Why is it here? It, why, why take out Nuketown 24-7? It just makes grinding that much more difficult, at least for like long shots and things like that. So I had to go into a hardcore face-off and get all these challenges done that way. The other thing I need to address is this item in the battle pass. I have no idea how I missed it. But you go in here and you go to about tier 61. <laughs> Look at this radical. It's literally just a ball sack. That's what I was rocking when I was going for my long shots. I just thought it was really important to let you guys know that there is a ball sack here in the battle pass. And before you get on me about being tier 60 something, I got the battle pass with uh, the 20 tiers or whatever. Just the first small bundle of it. And then I had a bunch of battle pass tier skips saved up. So I'm not that sweaty. I'm not paying that much. Here you go. This is what it looks like in gold. Honestly, this is probably one of the cleanest golds I've seen in this game. Insane coverage on these weapons. They've just blown it out of the park with the DLC weapon camo coverage diamond also looks awesome on it i can't say more about it than i've said about gold the just the coverage on these are amazing diamond always has the best coverage as well and then dark matter it's just absolutely perfect and also for those of you that are curious you just gotta go to reticles here once you unlock it go over to store and you scroll on over to your nuts Actually, it's it's supposed to be a Ouija board or whatever, but everyone knows what that is. Anyways, here's the attachments I was using. Keep in mind, I was playing hardcore and I was mainly going for long shots last time I used this weapon. So I have the Axial Arms three times scope. With the Task Force, it felt like the speed and the accuracy debuffs weren't worth it. So I was using the Takedown. Plus it's hardcore, so you don't really need that extra damage. Might switch to the Task Force in our next game. I was also using the SWAT 5 milliwatt laser because hip fire with this thing in hardcore is kind of nice. Field Agent Grip helped with the recoil and the Airborne Pistol Grip. 
rip with that ADS speed. Well, let's go see how this thing does in core. I'm gonna hit nuke jacked. If I get hijacked one time, we're playing face off. Yep, hijacked. I'm out of here. Nice try. On to face off. But since we are gonna hop into face off, I'm switching to the task force barrel. I took off the axial arms and I'm gonna put on the microflex LED and I gotta throw the nuts back on. All right, now we can play. Great. We we went from hijacked to u -bon. Now, don't get me wrong. u real nice for getting long shots especially when nuketown's gone oh but the most important thing i almost forgot this is what <sighs> see this is another bad thing about Ubon. where's the light at right here kind of works this is what come on dude give me a break here all right this is what the grav looks like with dark matter i'm sorry you can't see it very well we'll hop in a custom game after this and i'll be able to show you better right now we need feed but my review of the weapon it's it's pretty all right i mean in hardcore Every gun's gonna do decent. Every time I try to switch to core, like if I was like not getting enough kills or I felt like I was dying too much and trying to switch to core, it felt like this thing was like throwing a wet paper ball at people. Oh my God, I just got Tommied. I have to watch it. Okay, right to the knee. But it didn't feel like it was doing too much. Uh, I mainly, oh my God, again, back to back? Leave me alone. Is this what it feels like? You know what? I'm Tommying back. I missed both of them. And I still have stuns on this class. My whole class is out of whack. And I'm getting tomahawked. And I'm getting messed up. This has been a nightmare game. Okay, but back to the review of the weapon. Oh my god, the game's over. All right, well, I'll get into the review in the next game. The lighting's a little better here on KGV. So this is what it looks like better in dark matter pretty clean very good coverage like we stated before. But back to the review before I was so rudely tomahawked. It, it's all right. And I'm stuck. I'm just really not a core player. So it felt like I wasn't doing too much in core. Also, I feel like I always had to go with like meta builds in core, whereas in hardcore, I can kind of just use whatever I need for like whatever challenge I'm doing. But that's just probably my hardcore bias. The challenges on this thing, I felt like I got done in a really weird order compared to usual. Oh my, Lanta. The last thing I got done was long shots. I mean, usually, usually long shots are very close to being the last thing I get done, as well as Flora. But I got Flora done first this time pretty nice but kills behind cover we're not an issue with this i feel like face off is such a good game mode for kills behind cover there's a lot of stuff in the way Ooh, let's go but besides that the, the camo grind for this was was pretty all right and didn't really struggle too much it was just weird that i wasn't struggling with anything i think we're we're doing good now knock on wood let's see if we can keep this going let's go that's a five yeah don't repeat me let's go we're on a six Let's stim. We're about to be coming up these stairs. Guarantee it. Yup. Got the assist. Owned. Let's go, dude. Feels nice kind of doing well in multiplayer after not uh not playing it for a long time. It's probably that like SBMM decay. It'll catch up to me by the time I'm doing these other weapons. No. Oh, we got him. I was already saying no like I was going to die. I was prepared to die there. Oh, let's go. We're out of 10. Kind of crazy to be celebrating a 10 kill streak. But that's just where where we at in the state of SBMM. Oh, there's two of them. We got one. Let's go. No, there goes the streak. We're on a 12. Not bad, though. Okay, maybe I've given this gun a bad rep. Because now that I have the task force barrel and I'm actually kind of using more of a, a build that fits my play style, I'm doing a lot better than I was. Oh, my. I say that as I get macheted. But... I'm starting to get a feel for this gun in core. Every time I see something good about it, I die. So this gun is ass. I hate it. This is the worst thing I've ever used. Now I'm about to get a nuke. Never mind. <laughs> okay. So both those theories are wrong. But if I say it's all right, will I get a kill right here? I will. Let's go. Yeah, this gun's mid. It's so mid. Now they, now they know. They're playing us. Get owned. Also get owned, get tommied. One more. Oh, he dodged him. Ooh, it's looking very blue right now. The best thing about guns with like great camo coverage is you get to see a lot of the different colors of Dark Matter. A lot of people think it's just all purple, but there is a little light blue aspect to it. So when it's cycling through the pattern, you actually get to see a lot more of it when there's more gun coverage. Ooh, barely missed that Tommy. Oh, oh, come on. Let me get one of these. We got, we literally got one. I need to hit a Tommy though. It's been so long. Oh, I did hit a few while I was grinding it out, but we need one live right here, right now. Okay. Or we'll get neither. A 360 down the stairs. Come on. There's no time left. 18 seconds. Ugh, Tommy. No. Right here in the door. 
Beak it. Somebody. Please. Pick it up. No! Spawn fast! One second! Oh, that one was close. All right, so unfortunately, no Tommy's this video. But 33 and 21, honestly, not bad for me. We did pretty all right. We had a nice little streak there. And you know what? This gun's a little better than all right, I think. It's a, it's a pretty decent AR for this late of a drop for... You know, them not just dropping a super OP weapon to, uh, to drum up some hype for the game. And because I said it would, this is what it looks like in-game. No HUD, nice lighting here in the custom game. Very nice, actually. It looks so good in here. Way better than it did on U-Bahn, that's for sure. And I like how on the other side of the gun, if you could please flip it over. Thank you. Right there, over the finger. Come on, go back to it. It seems that that has a different pattern or like a or a different like lighting tone to it. Go ahead, go back to it right there. It really stands out. And we, we got the lever beads on here still too look at them uh but anyways we're all finished with the grab we got dark aether and dark matter on it next we're gonna be working on the axe and then after that the new shotgun so be on the lookout for those but i'm gonna have to end the video here if you guys like this you want to see more go ahead and leave a like on it if you didn't you don't dislike if you're new here please consider subscribing put out all kinds of cod content throughout the week that's gonna be it for me today i'll see you guys next time later